Hello everyone, welcome to Angels of the Earth Tarot. This is the monthly reading for November for Gemini guys, okay? So we'll just give your cards a shuffle. Now you're very welcome to join our Angels of the Earth Tarot Facebook group guys. Um, it is growing every day. Really popular. And um, we also have linked to it the Crystal Group now up and running as well on Facebook called Crystal Cottage. The two are linked. So we give away free readings from time to time on the Facebook group and just a bit of tarot. So if you would like to um, be a part of that, just look for the link in, in the box below this um, video, guys. Just click on that. It'll take you through some gorgeous crystals and things if you like that sort of thing and you browse through those on Crystal Cottage as well. The link to that is in the box as well. Both the links are there. And if you'd like at any time an extended video to these readings, you're very welcome to email me on angelsoftheearthtarot at gmail.com as well. That's also in the box. Everything's in the description box below the video. Okay, we're going to get your three main energies out now and see where you will be what energy you'll be sitting in during the month of November. Okay, guys. So first up, we have Four of Swords. Hmm. But it is in the um, reverse. So that's interesting. Oh, we have Ace of Wands. New opportunity. Ace of Wands is like a burning desire to do something, some a real passion for something. So there's something in a lot of your lives that it, you re either really want to do or you are doing at the moment okay we have ace of cups so for a lot yeah ace of but it's in the reverse so this is like an, an, a love opportunity for some of you that has gone wrong perhaps or yeah Okay, let's get some clarifying cards, guys, and see where this takes us, okay? We'll just give these cards a shuffle first. Because we don't know without our clarifying cards. Don't expand on it very much. Because it can go different ways for you. There's been disappointment in your life recently. Disappointment over something. But I see you're getting over that. That'll allow this new opportunity to move forward. Okay. Give your cards a cut. Now let's see about this ace in reverse. Oh. Immediately what came to me was passion. There's a loss of a loss of passion. That's what I hear is a lot of pa a lot loss of passion, a loss of courage. Also, I hear that a loss loss of courage towards something. So, for a lot of you or some of you, this is something to do with love. This is something to do with losing out on love. I hear losing out on love. I'm going to get, I don't usually get more than one card for these, but I'm going to, I'm going to get another card for that, guys. See if there's any other messages for it. What is this loss of love? Oh, look at that. We've got the Knight of Cups. So for some of you, there's been a loss of love. And this is this is somewhat something that you you had a lot of passion for a lot of you know it was quite something important in your life I, I feel but with this and you, it's it's gone it, it's everything's just being turned upside down so there's something's happened which has caused you to lose this in your life but I see the Knight of Cups here so someone's coming back guys Someone is coming back. And they're coming back with good intentions too. 
It's with good intentions to repair this. You may even get an apology from this. Let's have a look at this Ace of Wands thing, because this is something that you've been, some of you have been interested in, or you are enjoying at the moment. Oh, this new opportunity, this 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 passion, this um, this project, Wands of projects or or um, hobbies or something you love very much that you've got a lot of. Um, enthusiasm for this is happening in the home guys this is the home this is four of wands this is within your home environment and it's it's causing you happiness doing this in the home here so this is a good thing for you these energies are good energies here for you yes we have the two of wands again wands uh, but it's in reverse. Prior to this, I see you in the past being indecisive and not knowing whether to take this project on. Um, now I can see this is in the reverse, so I can see you moving ahead with this and enjoying it. It's making you happy. Now there is a card here with the Four of Swords, which is disappointment over something. So let's just have a look and see what we can get from that, guys. Disappointment. Yeah, so there's something that's being disappointing at some point. In the, you know, so these could be three different stories, okay? The three different messages coming through, so take it as it resonates because it is a general reading. For some of you, there's something that's caused disappointment and it could be with people around you, um, sort of like disagreements with this Five of Wands. So Spirit is saying here, if that's you, if this is resonating for you, then with the Hanged Man here, you need to look at things from a different viewpoint. If you look at things from a different perspective, things will work out for you. Okay? Yeah. See, I can see disappointment here. That's the two tie-in. Four of Swords and the Five of Cups is disappointment over something. Yeah. And for some of you, with the Hierophant in reverse, um, this can mean a loss of a family member. This can mean that this has sort of restricted you from doing things. What is happening here has restricted you from moving forward. It's sort of taken your strength away from you a little bit. Caused you to feel a little bit weaker in your energy. Yeah, and we have look, all the cards. I keep getting new new cards out. I don't normally get these amount of cards out, guys, but I am because it's just sort of, well, <laughs> because I like to see where it goes. <laughs> but they're all telling me the same thing, the nine of, so for some of you, there's something here that's caused you a lot of distress and disappointment. But the... Yeah, okay, so the last card I've got is, I always like to end on a positive note if I can, guys. Knight of Pentacles, if things are going to balance out and steady out, okay? It could be to, to, to do with money. This whole thing, disagreements, could be to do with money for some of you. But it, look at it from a different perspective. There's a different perspective that is going to come towards you that you need to take on board and look at it from. And things are going to, you know, perhaps listen to different viewpoints, their viewpoints perhaps, and then it will sort itself out, guys. It will balance out, okay? So that's all I have for you, um, Gemini. Thank you for joining us here on Angels of the Earth Tarot for your November read. Um, I will have other reads during November too. Please don't forget to um, have a look at our Facebook groups too, Angels of the Earth Tarot and Crystal Cottage. Um, like I said before, the links are in the box below this video. And before you leave, please don't forget to like and subscribe now to our channel here because that helps our channel grow. So bye for now.